Semi-final time for top alcohol, Alan Dobson, a 6.01 in the first round. Is the five second on? Certainly is. Uh, our crew chief, Greg Gower, he certainly uh, wound the wick right up then. We had plenty of horsepower on board the last time, and uh, I'd say this time's a real good chance of doing it, yeah. It's been cold and clear. The, the track's obviously cooling down. Obviously, it may be a bit slippery in the middle. Yeah, true too. Um, just belongs the traffic keeps rolling out there and the racing keeps going, uh, the, the, track temperature, the track temperature should stay with us. So um, hopefully it'll be OK and we're able to get down without kissing the wall or doing anything uh, naughty. Any surprises in the car for this round? Yeah, Greg's turned the wick up a bit more, as I say. He's screwed a bit more horsepower into it and uh, he's just said then, better hang on. Alan Dobson sounding supremely confident about his chances in the Castrol Funny Car of becoming the first top alcohol car to run into the elusive five-second barrier. Steve Harker, though, is formidable opposition, Kevin. Yes, Steve certainly is. He currently leads the Australian Top Alcohol Championship points for, but there's no doubt that the Dobson-Gower combination has been the car with the most horsepower in top alcohol this year. It's run a 6.01. It's repeated that again today, 235 mile an hour. They've certainly got the horsepower in the engine. All they've got to do is get the combination right with the clutch and get it down the track. Wherever you're watching right around Australia, welcome to our telecast of the 1993 Winfield Snap-on Tools Winter Nationals. You may be about to see history in Australian drag racing. That man on screen, Alan Dobson, all the way from Western Australia, against the banana vendor, Steve Harker, who puts a lot of time and money in the sport of top alcohol drag racing. They line up side by side in staging. Keep your eyes on the Castrol funny car of Alan Dobson. He might just do it here. He'll need brilliant reaction time, and he's very capable of that. Horsepower unleashed, green lights on simultaneously. A sensational run by the Castrol car, blasting across the bitumen here. A 5.904, they've done it. 